Hello everyone, my name is Muhammad Al Said. Um, I'm here again with another video. Um, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install Python. Um, and yes, for the people who doesn't know what programming is, programming is like programming our languages, which used to make experiments um, and games and too much like stuff. Okay, so now let's get started. First of all, let's see how to install Python. And guys, um, for who can't install Python, like for the copy of Windows that can't install Python, um, I'm going to give an example of another app with the same language. Okay, first of all, go to Google Chrome. Um, after enter Google Chrome, right? Python dot org here Python org and it will bring the logo here so enter to bring you here community success stories new events the combination downloads okay documentation downloads and about okay and it's here it can show you examples look print a like it will show you examples here let me highlight it here here so now let's get started how to install it when um here you can like press here or here so guys i already installed it so i don't need to install it again okay so now let's see for the people who can't install python on their windows copy so let's add a new tab google collab here google collab come to the first link here if you like the first link that you'll find is going to be this google collab if it wasn't google collab if like python data science handbook um this isn't google collab okay first of all come to here google collab and to make sure um you can look here and see google collab dot research dot google dot com okay press on google collab if you already have an account on your um google it will log you in here you're logged in so press on add a new notebook and here we go my collab is just loading to open and at the same time let's open our python here it's open let's see our python okay this is python let's see okay the first example like the easiest example is um now i'm telling you or teaching you how to print words okay so guys if you did any mistake like even a capital letter which doesn't need to be capital this will be counted as a mistake okay so let's see print you can see it um, the P is not capital and let's see will it be right or wrong print space um, print space what's it called um, brackets here then like those two commas wait then like yes those two commas is a mistake oh yes i did a mistake so let's see for the mistake that i did it was going to make like i need to write it again so here print let's see what's right hello world and like um and guys whatever is in the brackets okay whatever is in the brackets and those two um commas 
is going to be printed down here. Okay? Okay. Hello, world. RLD. Okay. Hello, world. And you need to copy the bracket and those commas here. And yes, let's see. Correct. Okay. So now let's see it here. And guys, I'm, I'm showing you what will happen if you made a mistake, okay? And on on Google Colab, it's like if you did a mistake, it's just, okay. On Google Colab, it's going to be like a bit difficult to get out your mistake. So let's see here. Mm, okay, let's see. P I R N T. This um, print isn't supposed to be written like this but i'm showing you now what is going to happen if um if you made the mistake so print here and then guys on google collab if you made a bracket or like a comma or anything it's going to be repeated on the other side okay so here hello world hello world okay wait i did a mistake um i pressed enter here on python you can press enter yes but here on google Colab, you need to press on this you need to press run okay or control enter on your keyboard You need to wait a little bit. You can see it's loading. And this it's going to be wrong. Why? Because P I R N T is not defined. They didn't find like part of they didn't find part of a code like they didn't find any code that has a word uh, that has a word called P I R N T. It's supposed to be P R I N T. I did the R um, in the place of the I, so it's wrong. Okay, now let's let's see here. Oh, and yes, guys, here the most like the last sentence you need to read it carefully. Okay, if you like, the last sentence is the sentence that will tell you what is the mistake that you did okay now let's get back to our python here on python i wrote p r i so it wasn't a mistake okay so that's the end of the video please guys don't forget to like and subscribe to my videos and guys, when I'm telling you, do not forget to like and subscribe to my videos. This also can be printed here. Print P. Print. Where is it? I did a mistake, the way. Let's see if it will work. And yes, it worked. So that's the end of the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Okay, this time it's not an example. Bye, see you in the next video.